77 Action News starts right now. A team of stars with deep Motown roots came together tonight to rock for jobs. The All-Star Jam helped drum up support for people unemployed in Metro Detroit. Action News reporter Glenda Lewis has the story tonight from downtown Detroit. stage lit up the Fillmore Theater downtown for those who are down on hard times. We're rocking for jobs tonight. Legendary Bob Seger saxman Alto Reed pulled together his all-star friends for a jam session that will provide serious help for Detroiters who need work. We said, let's do something really special for Detroit. Why not do a holiday celebration? Let's call on all your friends, all the great musicians around here, and work with Goodwill Industries. The money they make, 100% goes to relocating or retraining displaced workers, you know, who are out of, out of jobs. And we're, all the guys I called, Mitch Ryder, I said, Mitch, I'm doing this show. When I told him what it was about, he said, I'm in. Did Alto call on you and call on everybody to come together for this? Yeah, you organized it, right. It's incredible to know what we're going through, to have to live through it and still see this many people willing to, you know, we've got some big hearts here. And it's fantastic. At $10 a piece, the 2,600 seats inside were almost full to capacity, and it was enough to fill your heart. Musicians have always been giving people, and it's great to see the warmth that they have tonight for the city and for the community. I was born in Detroit. I'm a Detroit Redford High high school kid, and uh, we wanted to do something to help go dwell industry, so that's what it was all about. Before he hit the stage, Alto Reed took some time to meet and greet some of the people who are helping to make a brighter future for those who need it most. At the Fillmore downtown, I'm Glenda Lewis, Channel 7 Action News.